Guys, uh, when you're performing the roll through, it's very important to trap that, that far leg so that they can't backstep. However, if you miss and then they backstep, they're gonna land in a seated position, which is gonna be ideal to go into my crab ride from there. So let's take a look. So first I'm gonna demo without him backstepping and then I'm gonna show what happens when he backsteps and I miss my hand. So as soon as I'm here and I'm doing my push up and I roll through, my left hand has to grab right over here so that Elliot tried to do a backstep. He's, he's unable to, and now I'm able to insert my hook. However, if I miss this hand or he was able to beat me to the punch and he, and he steps this leg back and he sits, now I'm in a seated reverse elegiva and I can invert right away and go into my crab ride. So this hand is now gonna go on his far knee. I'm gonna spin myself under, insert my hook one, pull on my second hook two, reach for his hips, and now I'm in my crab ride position. I can start to go for the back or switch my hooks starts to go for my leg drag, etc. Whatever your preference is in the crab ride. Again. So here I missed his leg. So as soon as I did the push up, now he's able to fall. So I'm gonna spin. As soon as I spin hook one, problem with the second hook, right away reaching for his hip. I prefer going straight into the leg drag position. However, for the crab ride specialist, you can veer off into any direction you wanna go to. So guys, as soon as I'm going for um, the initial push-up and he steps his leg up, now I'm gonna roll through. As I roll through, if I can trap this leg, then I can have the back or I can start to go for the saddle. However, if I miss and my partner back steps this leg, they end up in a seated position right in front of me. So here, it's an it's optimal position to go into the crab ride. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take my free hand, I'm gonna go underneath his knee, to create the space to invert. I'm gonna invert in between his legs, insert my hook, pommel my second hook, start to connect the hips, and now I'm in the crab ride. From here, you can do anything you want to, or you can start to look for the leg drag, which is my personal preference. So on the landing, we land with Elliot's seat in front of me, and my hook, like a reverse delegable hook. So now I have the same leg controlled. I'm gonna use my other hand to go under his, under his knee, and now I'm gonna spin with my head right in between his legs. Here, my hook is gonna come A, palm up my second hook B, and then from here, I'm gonna start to look for both of his hips. And then from here, there's many, many possibilities. One way that I like to do it is to clear my hook, come on top, and look for my leg drag right away.